Behind me is a brand new kayak trailer that I'm gonna be using this year that I'm gonna walk you through why I think it's the best option if you're looking for an affordable way to get your kayak from point A to point B. Let's go. Here it is. This is actually an easy loader jet ski trailer that I've modified and adjusted slightly in order to make it work absolutely perfectly for my 13 and a half foot fishing kayak. Easy Loader has been making boat trailers since 1953 and are the trailer manufacturer of some of the most well-known boat brands in the industry, like Bennington and Skeeter to name just a couple. There are a lot of great things about their trailers, but one of the standout things when it comes to their aluminum trailers is they have a patented revolutionary I-tube beam aluminum that conceals brake lines and wiring and adds additional strength and durability to the aluminum trailers. This specific trailer is a single place all aluminum jet ski trailer that I purchased for right at $19.99.99 plus tax and a spare tire. I'll leave a link to the trailer below the like button in case you want to check it out too. So why did I buy a jet ski trailer instead of a kayak trailer? Let me show you. It's super lightweight. Coming in at just 268 pounds, I'm able to move it easily by hand. It's super low to the ground, just 20 inches from the bottom of the kayak to the ground when it's loaded on the trailer. So I'm able to launch it right off the trailer. No more lifting or dragging or putting it in or on your vehicle. It has a lower center of gravity on the trailer, making it easier to tow. With a 1,250 pound capacity, it has plenty of room for additional modifications or if you wanna add a second level for another kayak, rod tubes, lights, etc. Some of the stuff that I'm gonna do and I'll post up when I do. It has an adjustable winch post on the front. It has adjustable bunks, composite fenders, side mount spare tire, spring axle suspension, radial tires and wheels with oil bath hubs. And it comes with either silver painted or galvanized steel wheels. So in order to make this work perfectly for my kayak, what I did is I moved these bunks in on the trailer so that my kayak will actually fit right down the center. So when I pull the trailer into the water and I go to load it up, I can bring the kayak straight down the middle and it'll center it. And it actually supports the kayak on the bottom as I'm going down the road to make it super steady and level and stable for the straps. On the front, there is a winch. It doesn't have your normal hookup on the front of it, but it has a handle on the front of the kayak, which works great for me to load the kayak on here in the water. And before I pull the trailer out of the water, hook the winch around the front handle to keep it in place, pull it out, center it up, and then winch it down the rest of the way. I use these auto retracting ratchets for the sides, which is great because you don't have that loose end hanging there. I'll leave a link to these down below the like button as well if you want to pick some up. And now that you know which trailer I recommend, check out this other video on my channel for more tips. And until next time, take it easy.